Yeah, so governor's school is for any students who will be um, going into the 11th or 12th grade. So it's our current um, sophomores and juniors this year can apply for governor's school. Yeah, so governor's school, there are 11 governor's schools in the state of Tennessee, and it's everything from governor's school for humanities, for prospective teachers, engineering, governor's school for the arts. Um, they are just opportunities to come together. They're typically about three week programs over the summer. Um, and it's an opportunity for students who are interested in similar things to come together, work with some of the, the top people in that field um, in our state, um, and learn more about the things that they're passionate about. So it's an opportunity to learn and grow and be um, exposed to other people with similar interests and network um, as well. Well, I know some of the governor's schools you can actually earn college credit for. Um, so you're going, you're taking college level courses, um, potentially earning college credit, which of course is a huge benefit. But like I said, it's also just kind of networking with people that are in that field. So um, if that means internships, job opportunities, potential scholarships, um, all of those have been results of governor's school before. So there are really endless opportunities that can come from that. So governor school is in the summer. Um, each so the eleven different governor schools they all happen on different college campuses in the state of Tennessee. Um, they run typically like the first three weeks of June, so like June first, June second for three weeks. Um, the application deadline last year was December first. They haven't released the deadline yet for this year. Um, governor school for the arts did have an earlier deadline. It was November first. So that's definitely something just to kind of be. Um, looking at and looking for. I always preface to students though, the deadline is December 1st, but there are, the applications are pretty lengthy. They require several teacher recommendation letters, um, some essays, so don't wait until like November 30th to start it because there is um, quite a bit of work that goes into those applications. So they happen on different college campuses. Um, so everything from like the, the Governor's School for Agriculture happens on UT Barnes campus. Um, I believe the Governor's School for the Arts happens on NTSU's campus. I know there are um, courses on UTK's campus, Tennessee Tech. Um, so they are all over our state. Well, it's an incredible opportunity. Um, it's a great way to meet new people that have the same passions as you do. It's a great way to um, explore different opportunities. It's a great way to, um, yeah, just grow, grow as a person. So I'm a huge advocate of Governor's School. I think um, anybody who's interested should apply because it is an incredible opportunity. It is free for students to attend Governor's School. Um, there's no cost associated. I know some schools, specifically the Governor's School for the Arts, there are program fees. Um, those differ from program to program, but there are scholarships that are available for those if there is a financial need. So don't let the possibility that there is like a student fee prevent you from applying to Governor's School. We have plenty of resources. Governor's School has plenty of resources. Um, so there's no, no cost associated with it. Other than that, talk with your teachers. Um, Look at the different websites that, that they have, that governor schools have, that they've got tons and tons of information about classes that students take. And it's more than just about classes. They also are doing different socialization things. And there's um, lots of fun outings that they do together. So it's not just school. It's not just going over the summer and having school. There's um, just a lot of fun, a lot of good stuff. I've never had a student go that didn't come back with great things to say about it. I will add that. OK. Do you think that's good? Okay, I think we're done. Well, if you need anything more, you can always come back down. If you get up and you